Gail King. Out of pocket for that shit. Way out of pocket. What do you gain from that? I swear to God, we the worst. We the fucking worst. We expect more from you, Gail. Don't you hang out with Oprah? Why y'all attacking us? We your people. You ain't coming after fucking Harvey Weinstein asking them dumbass questions. I get sick of y'all. I want to call you one. Is it okay if I call her one? Funky dog head bitch. How dare you try to tarnish my motherfucking homeboy's reputation, punk motherfucker. Respect the family and back off, bitch, before we come get you. Yes, to my people, if you know tuning in and you know trying to figure out what this is all about, this brewing saga is like a cup of coffee right now brewing at your favorite coffee shop. This is Harvey Weinstein on the left and Gail on the right. Gail is Oprah friend and her name is Gail King. That's Gail King in focus right now. And she had an interview on CBS with Lisa Leslie, which is Kobe friend. They've been friends for years, right? She used to play in the WNBA, Kobe playing in the NBA. Now, Oprah, who is Gail King friend, actually good friend, you know, um, it seems to be something been going on for years. It was only now people talking about why are they targeting us, but they've been doing that according to some people, right? And what happened now, um, Gail King asked Lisa Leslie about Kobe Bryant um, sexual encounter with this young lady um, that took place around 2003-2004, somewhere around there, you know? The point is that a lot of people find that it was it was irrelevant at the time of the death of Kobe Bryant that his family is in mourning and a lot of other people, relative and close friends, are in grief. And why would you try to tarnish this man's reputation by bringing up something to brew again on top of what is already taking place? Now, some people find she was appropriate, not too much, I believe so. But I will still give the level playing field. And a lot of people find that she was being disrespectful and inconsiderate. So this is what I have to say. So Gail posted the question to Lisa Leslie. Do you think his legacy is complicated because some are saying his, his legacy is complicated because of sexual assault charges that was in 2003-2004? And that sent Snoop Dogg and other celebrities through the wall because they find now at the end of the day, yes, these things probably might have taken place. But Kobe is dead and gone and you had ample time to ask Kobe these type of questions. Why you don't ask Harvey Weinstein, the person who you and Oprah is friend. As you can see, Gail in a picture here with Harvey Weinstein. It even bring out Bill Cosby. And also make Boozy Badass had to put a foot in it. So here's Boozy about this. Gail King, why the fuck would you ask some shit like that? I don't give a fuck who friend it is. I don't give a fuck she can Obama. Uh oh. Why the fuck would you do something like that? Why would you do that to your people? You know what people are going through, right? Why would you ask a fucking question like that, trying to tarnish somebody's image? You do that to your own black people. You say it. I'm finna fire your ass up. You say it, bro. People be talking, black people need to stop fucking trying to hurt black people for success. So all the reason you ask that fucking shit for to get your fucking numbers up. Give a fuck who you can to. So now, this is my thing to you all people. Do you think that what Gail said was appropriate? Right? Um, because there goes Oprah and Weinstein. You can see they have a good connection, good chemistry. They always meet, hug, kiss. Right? 
And Oprah Winfrey is not only um, Harvey Weinstein's friend, she's a lot of other celebrities' friend. Look at Harvey Weinstein. Gail was also friend with Harvey Weinstein. That's why Snoop Dogg say, when is that video coming out? When is that interview? She was friend with Matt Lauer, right? If you can remember, he was accused of sexual assault. I mean, uh, um, uh, on female. So it's funny, you know, that these celebrities, I mean all, not just one, all these celebrities have a lot to say, right? And they are part of the same thing. Anyway, this is stop by, share, like, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Hit that notification.